key role of the board is to understand what the top risks are and bring them into the conversation. So adding cyber as a permanent agenda item is incredibly important so that a curious board can become informed. And one of the best ways to do that is to actually make sure that it is part of the risk committee. It's Yes, it will be on our risk register, but it is actually something that our risk committee does actually look into and bring scenarios and information to the board. And as I said before, if you make it a standing board agenda item, then it is discussed. And it's that anything, any questions that the board asks creates activity within an organisation. And it is that activity that creates the culture. And David, I think you'd agree that you can't be expecting the directors to be governance cyber security experts, but we expect them to be really curious and ask questions. And the committees as well mean that connection with the executive and the staff asking the questions at that level. And David, we've even have examples of organisations that have designated cyber committees when they've decided that this is a big enough risk to have a cyber committee and that's where they bring that expert in. Mm. 